Good morning. Welcome to day 11 of our UK trip. I think the enthusiasm is waning. No, it's not. It's really not. No. We're not. We're just all a little bit sleepy, a little bit tired. I am full of a cold. I've not had a cold for so long. I think it's just because we've been go, 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 go. We are, I say we, I use the royal we. Harry, Emily and David are off climbing this morning. They're going on a treetop aerial adventure. Grandad and I are holding the bags and watching. I really thought I was going to have to do it this morning because Emily's not been great. So I thought I was going to have to take her place rather than lose all the money. Are you excited? Yep. Yep. So I lost the group. I'm just going to go and find them. I was trying to see if we could change swimming. There seems to be a lot of availability. Um, I don't even know if I want to go swimming. I'm really tired this morning. Lots of people out on the lake paddle boarding, canoeing. Let's show you. I just need to go and try and find them. I think they are up here somewhere. But it looks like an absolute maze of trees and ropes. I've got no idea where they are. So this is where you come for the tree trek challenge, the action challenge. Um, it's obviously got a minimum height restriction for the different challenges. Um, the base is just here. You've got all the helmets and the harnesses over there and the instructors are in red helping you do it. And this is just behind the lake. You can just about see the lake. Just there is the lake. That's so high. How are the nerves, guys? No nerves at all. I'd be like this now. Until I got up there. Looking good? So Harry is all now getting strapped up and so is Emily and then David's over there, all very safe and secure, lots of checks being done, brave, brave people. And she's off. She's a lot braver than I am. Harry's up next. And Harry's next. He's just been taken up by the instructor because he's just about reached that on his tiptoes. And David's off next. That's it, Harry, doing so good. Just take your time. That's horrible. So there has been a massive traffic jam 
just because I think someone's a bit scared further around so the instructors have had to go and rescue them so there has been a bit of a traffic jam so the kids and David have been sat up there for a while waiting to go across this thing seems to be on the move now so hopefully we'll keep going not quite sure if you can see it but Harry's dancing up there so Emily is just on top of the zip wire right up there and so is Harry too I'm just going to watch them come down and then that's the last bit so they're obviously waiting for the signal for the guy back here I think they've given him a, a go and they're going to go in a minute just doing the final checks oh there's my babies Three, two, one, go! Oh, I'll count again. Here they go! Hello! Hi, Harry! David is just on top of the zip wire pole waiting to go down. Needs to wait for the all clear from over here. They're still unhooking Harry at the moment. And then he's gonna go. Doing the final checks again. The wave the flags at both ends. And here he comes. How amazing were they? I'm so very proud of them. It's not so warm this morning though, and I've got some <laughs> only got shorts on and I'm freezing. I'm gonna go and find them at the end of the zip wire and then walk back with them and find out if they enjoyed it or not. I'm pretty sure they probably did. Here they come now. How was that guys? Good. Did you really enjoy that? Yeah. Oh cool. What was the best bit? The, the end. The zip wire. Yeah. That tree looked a little close. No it doesn't from this angle but when you're up there. Okay. That was not that tight. So we have just come to the sports cafe for lunch. I have got soup and a sandwich. It looks quite good actually. Harry's got cheeseburger, cheer up a bit. David's got bread and butter with a roast amount of chips, and Harry's definitely got cheese toast and cheese up too. I'm going to tuck in because I'm starving. Just having a wander through the plaza again, seeing what shops we can see. Uh, which shops we're going to? So around Centre Park, if you do any of the activities like the climbing or the aerial tree trek, they give you a band to wear uh, with sort of QR codes on that you scan <laughs> as you're going round and that then it comes up here. That's you, you that's them. me, that's me in the beehive. Oh, very cool. You can this see I did... It's really clear, isn't it? Yeah, very cool. There's David and Harry. You can tell I didn't know that. That is really cool, a great through. addition. I love it. Just in the toy shop with Harry. He's having a look round. Oh, the t shirts are so cute. Oh, that one. I see a panda on the Yeah. You do not need any more pandas. Never do. Oh, look, the Disney section. Mr. Hanky, the Christmas food. Mr. What? Mr. Hanky, the Christmas food. Where's that? South Park. Let's get a princess. Oh, what is going on with? 
that face. <laughs> that is not Buzz Lightyear. That's Buzz Lightyear. That's not. He's really high, there. He's had too much Botox. <laughs> no, look at it. Now that's funny. <laughs> Hello. Jumanji. Hey. The big the big battleships is eighteen pounds. The tiny battleships is eight pounds. So here you've got the House of Games in the plaza. It's got lots of just arcade games for the kids. Lots of places for parents to spend their money. Lose money, lose money. Duckling flight, fight even. Just a few things to keep the kids entertained. Nowhere in Sense Parks currently accepts um, cash or you have to pay everything by card. So in here you have to use your card and you get tokens. Uh, we found out on our first day that Nowhere accepts cash. You have got a leisure bowl here. Um, lots of lanes, all funky, neon. How cool is that, Harry? quite a few lanes and a bar over there. As with all the other restaurants, you can scan the QR code. Oh, there's the camera. Hello. You can scan the QR code and they will bring the drinks to your table. Forget your swimming costume, Aquatic has got you covered. And your goggles and your inflatable boats, because that's just what you need. I know, they're all dead fat, aren't they? I that one used to be skinny one. A bit like your dad. <laughs> he used to be skinny too. <gasps> True. So this is an indoor play area. I'm not even sure if it's in use because I've not seen anybody in it yet. Um, don't know. Okay, so you get in through it through Hooks, the American restaurant, which is just up and around this corner. So this is Las Iguanas where we unfortunately are not going to be able to go. But the menu did look really good. I was going to get the margarita. Don't care about the food, I wanted one of them. American sweets. I hate, I do not like birds. So the pick a mix has obviously gone right now, and they've got little bags, all, all sweets all bagged up, and you can pick a large bag, five pound, a regular four pound, or one pound per bag, or six for five pound. Gosh, that's a mouthful. We've got all this choice here. Yeah. 
and then you've got the pick a mixture on the other side. So we're back from our bike ride. We've had a half an hour to an hour of chill out time and dinner's arrived. We've got a takeaway. I've ordered from the Indian Harry, um, Harry, that's Alan, has ordered from, or Crazy Granddad, has ordered from Hooks, and they've ordered from Bella Italia, and it's not arrived yet. Pizza's arrived. It was like an earthquake with the cutting of the table. Like, it's like turbulence. Good evening from the swimming pool. It's night time and we've come for a nice swim. The night time swim that the kids and David really, really wanted. It's quite chilly out. I just went outside. Yeah. Still waiting for the lights to come on though. The lights haven't come on just yet. Yeah, those ones haven't, but the pool lights haven't. Yeah, it has been. The pool lights aren't on. Uh-oh. No, it's there. There's one over there. Oh, okay. The tree's on. We've got to go down the rapids for a night swim in a minute. back from the dome now had a great lovely night swim um all really 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 tired another amazing day here obviously i was a bit more chilled out this morning just watching david and the kids climbing um then we obviously went on a bike ride and uh, that lovely swim takeaway fabulous that was really really nice but sad now because we're packing we're packing oh. But we're not going home, are we? David? Hmm? Not going home, are we? No, not for a while. Still not going home. Very, very tired. We're heading off on the next part of our adventure tomorrow. We are heading into London. London, baby, yeah! What film was that from? Austin Powers? Yeah, I think that was it. Um, yeah, we're heading into London for the next part of our trip. We are going to the Premier Inn. Uh, near Tower Bridge, we're heading to London Eye, we're heading on uh, Madden Two Swords, obviously, and Tower of London. A couple of Merlin attractions, and then obviously the Tower of London, which isn't which Harry really wanted to do, and Crazy Grandad. Crazy Grandad is coming with us um, for the next bit, so that's going to leave you here for today, because I can't speak anymore. Don't forget to give us a big thumbs up, leave any comments down below. Have you been on the aerial adventure? Would you do it? Because I don't know if I could do it. Um, and don't forget to subscribe. And thank you so much if you've been watching along. I really, really appreciate it. And I'll see you again in the next one. Bye!